reading please subscribe and um, yeah let's start with your reading so the moon's in cancer today and the moon day is one so it's a good day um, for solitude and to take some time out for yourself remember guys that emotions are very um, changeable today the sun is at the 20th 21st degree of cancer so the question of today courtesy of Dame Rodder is what is success really um, worth so as you can see we've got the eight of wands which is your first card so this is the obstacle to you know you enjoying the present moment which is um, seen in the fourth of wands there so there's a lot of energy in the air right now for some of you you may feel an emotional pause so just take some time out and pamper yourself a bit you don't have to spend lots of money you could sit in the garden go for a walk in the park or whatever it is that will uplift you at the present for some of you stuff may you know um go go a bit crazy um because of a lot of information is coming in for some of you at from all directions as seen in the um cards just try and stay calm the best thing you can do at the moment is not to raise the debate and to think very clearly before you react. Some of you may be planning a trip overseas or maybe offered a job overseas um, or some of you may just go overseas in relation to your um, career. The main theme of the day is growth even through the darkness. Things are moving very quickly in communication. Some of you may get news you've been waiting for for a while. For those of you who have been working on the project or some grand idea, your goals are within reach, so just keep on going and the outcome will satisfy you. Make sure you keep an eye on your budgets today. Do not overspend, especially in business uh, matters. So, um, you know, try and do all you can today to make yourself um, feel secure, you know, because insecureness will uh, mess up um or the good that's being offered the eight of wands in astrology represents sagittarius aries so enterprising and mutable cardinal energy jupiter and mars mars is squaring uranus at the moment so just think before you act and ignore all kind of aggression jupiter has gone direct so this is another clarifier that the abundance shown by the cards is being offered and the astrological movements is um or um in alignment to what the cards are saying as well so um yeah the opportunities that's been offered to anyone right now um is that um the fourth of one right now the planetary energies are offering everyone a chance to walk into their own happiness now remember this is not what you've told happiness is but what is happiness to you follow your own bliss find your bliss follow it a homecoming is being offered um abundance of mind body and soul so do not like the pressures that may be coming in um you know we're shown by this eight of wands cards here distract you from you know the change and blessings which are being offered harmony peace and satisfaction are being offered to those who wish to make the actual practical changes in their life the harvest will come home to you if you stay focused on your inner path on guidance so yeah, if you've sown seeds in the previous cycle, then your harvest will come over the summer. If you've not been working on anything, then the time is right for you to make new plans and sow your seeds so you can reap within the next cycle. So yeah, some of you um, will have a romantic day. Some of you have already planned this. Uh, some of you may be swept off your feet, so to speak. I have a good vibe about this, but remember to always, you know, keep both um, feet on the ground, you know. Wands is all about things and um, things on earth, you know, groundedness. Some of you may be getting married today, so I hope everything goes um, well. And others may get, you know, engaged also as well. So, um, yeah, just see the blessings in the little things, like the song of the bird in the tree. Focus on the little things you can appreciate in life and the big things will come in um, cards. So in the future card, what's being offered to you, all those, in, you know, things are never set in stone. But how I read astrology and tarot is, you know, showing you the energy that's, you know, being offered to you by the cards and, uh, you know, the planets in the sky. So the two of wands um, corresponds with Virgo, which is in Venus at the moment, Leo, which is in Mercury at the moment, and the sun, which is in Cancer. So just another confirmation, you know, that the tarot and astrology is lining up as it always does. So, yeah. If you remain in your own energy, finding some solitude today, focusing on the now, 
planning for the future yes but focusing on the now letting go of the past and no seeds of practicality and change will bear fruition in the future so just stand firm in your convictions and trust and follow your own in a direction so it's another indicator that some of you may get some recognition for a job well done today plans made, plans made today will bear fruit it's moon day number one so you know plant one so the 30 day cycle you know you harvest in the next cycle so yeah it's a good day for planting the seeds of creation if you have the courage and stand firm in your own convictions and thought you will be rewarded by the celestial body so yeah um, today is a day where intuition is high, so some of you may get inspirational thoughts that will lead you to your highest life direction. Remember, perseverance is the key in life. Never, never, ever give up. Believe that. Again, um, going back to the important communication I said um, some of you may get, which is shown by the Eight of Wands. This is another indicator that some of you may complete, receive an important letter or contract but check all the details first um, some of you may enter a new business contract today um, stay firm in your negotiations but be flexible enough to accommodate the needs of the other parties um, for you water signs um, or those with um, water energy ruling the chart the seeds are really ripe um, for planting today today is a good Day to work with leafy vegetable or, or even to plant or leafy plants it's a good day to work with nature so yeah just try and go with the flow and that's your reading please subscribe i will be doing daily readings and meditation thanks for watching